Hi there, so I'm John Tripp and this is my contribution to Meet the Tutor for Gloucestershire Music. Um, so I conduct a Gloucestershire Youth Orchestra and also write music. This is uh, one of my pieces, Half the Five Valleys, uh, played in the background, you can hear. So if you don't listen to me, you can listen to that instead. So I've been with Gloucestershire Music now for 30 years. I know it's unbelievable, isn't it? Um, I started in September 1991 at uh, Cotswold Music Centre so um, I grew up in Gloucestershire, I learned violin, viola and piano and I played in the Gloucestershire Youth Orchestra and under Mark Foster and um, my, my last concert was in, uh, after our Bavarian tour of 1987 which was great fun. It's good to know that um, sort of Gloucestershire Music is uh, hoping to run uh, tours in the near future so you'll hear more about that as well uh, as time goes on. My first conducting experience uh, actually was after that uh, tour. I persuaded the conductor to let me sort of stand in front of the orchestra and conduct my own piece before I went to university, and, and bless him, he did. So um, I conducted my symphonic study, and that was my first time um, waving a stick. And it was a great experience. I've really learned a lot from it. And I hope that that's an experience we can give members of uh, the youth orchestra and gospel music compose and to conduct music. So I then went to Birmingham University and I studied music and uh, I also studied um, violin and piano at uh, the Birmingham Conservatoire. That was part of the course. You had your lessons at the Conservatoire and uh, some of my great teachers. Uh, Jeremy Ballard who, uh, for violin who led the second violin the to the Birmingham Symphony Orchestra. Elizabeth Mackay on uh, for piano, who sorted out my piano technique, um, and then Piers Lane, who was uh, uh, taught this uh, piano my second year, um, was an international service, so it was, had some really inspiring times there. I then um, I, I also con uh, composed, continued to compose, and um, conducted the University Chamber Orchestra, and then I came back to Gloucestershire. I actually worked in a plastics factory for a year, which was a great experience actually, I really enjoyed it. Um, I worked with autistic adults, I did music sessions uh, with uh, groups of them, um, which was challenging work, rewarding but very challenging. And then um, some teaching sort of came up at Stroud High, um, I tried it out um, and absolutely loved it. I sort of found, you know, this is, this is what I want to be doing. Um, so I've continued my teaching ever since uh, in Gloucestershire and in the schools, um, teaching violin and viola, running string groups and orchestras. And I've been involved in Gloucestershire Music, um, running, uh, so I was uh, involved at the Cotswold Music Centre right at the beginning. And then I uh, moved to Five Valleys Music Centre and then conducted um, Gloucestershire Area Youth Orchestra uh, about um, under 20 years ago. And then about five years ago, um, well before then I was um, also doing string coordinating for the county, so running with different uh, violin um, projects, uh, strings for all different levels, um, one of which became, uh, became a sort of big string project which still runs today. Um, and then five years ago I sort of um, took on Gloucester Youth Orchestra, uh, which I actually loved doing. Um, I also conduct, so that's not a lot of conducting, um, I also conduct Stroud Symphony Orchestra, a local amateur orchestra, and a local chamber orchestra, a Capriol Chamber Orchestra. And did about sort of, 10 years of coaching, uh, string coaching, uh, and conducting for a uh, national children's orchestra, which is a great experience. Um, in contact with this wonderful team of tutors there. So, so that's a little bit about me, what I do. Um, so we've got a great team at Gloucester Music um, who just love making music, love sharing our experience with music. Um, I absolutely adore ensemble music, orchestral music, singing um, and sort of playing any opportunity you can get. Um, so I just really enjoy it. And, and hopefully, um, I, hopefully my, my passion for music um, and that sort of sense of enjoyment and ex the excitement discovering this great wealth of music out there. Hopefully that comes across um, 
is what I do and I continue to do the glossy music. So that's a little bit. And thank you. Thanks for listening. <laughs>